how to maneuver ship station how to ship through ship station how to set up your ship station how the ship station even works ton when i say a ton i mean a ton of questions no basic zone This is Shangish Girl Sushi back with another video. If you're new, then hey, boo, welcome to my channel. My name is Sushi. Be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so that way you can officially become a part of the Sush Gang and also ring that bell so that way you don't miss out on any of my future entrepreneur uploads or any of my future beauty videos. And if you're a part of the Sush Gang, if you're one of my lovely returning subscribers, then welcome back to the channel, you guys. You guys know I'm always happy to have you guys back to check out a brand new video. So today's gonna be an entrepreneur episode. I gotta figure out what episode number we're at because to be honest, I haven't put up a video entrepreneur related in a little while you guys know that and I know you guys are probably sad you guys are disheartened but it's okay we're back let me just check real quick what number we're up to 10 seconds later episode 28 wow we might have to stop numbering them we might have to stop numbering them because we're, we're getting up there so with that being said today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to maneuver or actually how to set up your ShipStation account or link your ShipStation account with your Wix account so if you are a business owner and your e-commerce website is Wix today I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can set up your ShipStation account or if you're thinking about getting ShipStation if I've encouraged you to get ShipStation I'm gonna show you guys how you can set up or link your Wix account to your ShipStation account so that way you can ship your orders through ShipStation I've gotten a ton when I say a ton I I mean a ton of questions from you guys asking you guys asking me how to maneuver ship station how to ship through ship station how to set up your ship station how the ship station even works so today I'm going to be showing you guys how to link your um, Wix website to your ship station I do have a few videos showing you guys how I ship through ship station um, from my Wix platform and check the description box down below for the full entrepreneur playlist so with that being said I don't want to chat too much today I'm just gonna be hopping on the computer and showing you guys how to link the two sites so hopefully this video helps a ton of you guys um, I know a lot of you guys have qu had questions regarding this so hopefully this dedicated video can help you guys and if you still have questions or have any future questions after you've linked your um, Wix to your ship station then just leave those questions down below I'm always checking the comments so I'll get back to you I answer all my comments within the same day or at least the next day so leave your comments down below if you still have any questions don't forget to give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video with no further ado let's get into it so I've been receiving a lot of questions about ship station how to maneuver ship station so today I'm going to show you guys how to set up an account how to link your Wix profile or your Wix account to your ship station account so that you can ship through ship station Go ahead and open up your site on Wix. Now we're going to open ShipStation. So I'm just gonna type ShipStation in the browser. And if you wanted to test out ShipStation, you can do so for free for 30 days. You don't even have to put in a credit card. If you were thinking about trying it out, then I'm here to let you guys know that you can indeed try it for free. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna click try for free and go ahead and create an account. Once you create an account, they'll also allow you to create a stamps account, which will allow you to ship through USPS or UPS at a discounted rate. They work hand in hand with ShipStation. So that way you can get discounted shipping rates every single time that you um, ship out an order. So I'm gonna go ahead and create an account as if I don't already have an account for ShipStation. Okay, I've jumped right back onto Wix and I'm actually on the edit portion and I'm actually on the edit page for my website. So right along the edit page on the left handle, you guys will see all those different buttons. You're gonna scroll down to or hover over the fourth button. The fourth button is gonna be the app market where you can find the ShipStation app so that way you can pair Wix to your ShipStation account that you just created. So once you've clicked the app button, you can go ahead and start typing in ShipStation in the app market. Once you've typed that in, go ahead and hit install. As you guys can see on my website, it has already been installed because of course that's what I used to ship. You can also do so by heading back over to ShipStation and going to your account and go ahead and click that little circle on the top right portion of the browser. Then you're going to go ahead and click on the left hand side of the ShipStation browser. You're going to go ahead and click um, selling channels under account. Go ahead and hit store setup and that's where you'll be able to connect your account to your ShipStation account. You just go ahead and hit connect a store or marketplace. Once you've hit that button, you'll see all of the different places that you can pair your ShipStation account to all the different e-commerces. Shopify is on here, Squarespace is on here, and Forcefix is on here. We're only talking about Wix today, so go ahead and find Wix and hit that button. And it will lead you back to Wix. Easy as one, two, three. Easy as pie. Easy as 
that's all I can remember for right now. So yeah. So at this point, you go ahead and click allow and add, and it should lead you right back into Wix. That way you can pair your Wix to the ShipStation app. I did also want to note that ShipStation has a ton of different subscription plans that you can choose from. You can either do the $9 per month subscription that allows you to ship up to 50 orders per month or you can invest in the $49 a month um, subscription that allows you to ship up to 1,500 orders per month. It really just depends on how many orders you would get in a month. That's the best way for you to choose what subscription plan is going to be best for you. So yeah, I did want to throw that out there. ShipStation has a variety of different subscription plans that you can choose from. So I hope this helped you guys a ton. Um, if you still have questions, as I mentioned in the beginning of today's video, be sure to leave them down below. I'll be sure to get back to you. As you guys saw in today's video, you can use ShipStation with a ton of different e-commerce websites, whether it be Shopify or whether it be Square. Is it Square? Squarespace? Squarespace, I'm sorry. <laughs> yes, Squarespace. So um, you could definitely look into that if your website is on a different e-commerce platform. But as you guys know, my brand, Upper NYC, is on the Wix platform. So I hope this video was super helpful. I hope you guys learned a lot from it. Again, if you have any more questions, leave them down below. If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. And if this video helped you out, give me a big thumbs up so that way I know and I can continue to create content like this for you guys. If you still haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. And while you're at it, ring the bell so you don't miss out on any of my future entrepreneur videos or any of my future beauty uploads or any of my future vlogs. So if you're just here for my entrepreneur videos, I highly suggest that you watch at least one of my other videos that are not entrepreneur related because I guarantee you're going to love the content, okay? And I'm not going to hold you guys here any longer i'm not gonna hold you guys here for much longer so so with that being said i love you guys until next time until the next video until the next upload until the next post i'll see you guys all later bye guys